What's up everybody? Welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today I'm going to show you how to make power cord net. You can make hammock out of power cord net, you can make power cord net bag and of course you can catch fish with that. There's multiple uses for this kind of thing. Just be creative and see what you want to build with this. So what we're going to do is tie up the rope like this on the two trees. Okay, what we're going to do is fold the rope in half like this. Boom. Hang it over and put it to the loop right here. Boom. Just like that. And then tie it up. And then we're going to put few inches apart like this. And just continue as long as you want it to. So this is what it's going to look like. Next what we're going to do is grab these two pieces. Boom. And make a simple knot right here. Make a loop and put it to. Boom. Something like that as you can see. And same thing on the same height. Right here. Same height, just twist it over, make a loop and then put it into the loop. Adjust it so it sits pretty nicely. Something like that. And same thing right here. Boom. And we're just gonna continue to the rest of them the same way like that. As you can see I can actually do it pretty fast. Once you get it, how to do it, it's nothing difficult. Just keep making knots and just make sure they kind of leveled, similar, don't have to be too crazy. Once you finish this step, next step is right here. Just make it kind of symmetrical. Again, whatever you're happy with. Boom. You see, that's pretty symmetrical. Just gonna tie this up right here. Adjust it, boom. And continue the same way, you see? Make it kind of similar angles. So that way it does not look too ugly. You see, this is pretty much matching and continue to the rest of them. Quick update how I've been doing. I'm about to finish it up and show you how to tie this rope to this rope. Look at Hugo watching me making this video. He's so cute. He's always around me when I'm making a video. And to finish it up, it's pretty easy. What we're going to do, grab these two ends, put it inside. Boom. And then Tie this together and then make a couple of knots. That'd be pretty good. Then we're going to trim up some ends and so the rope doesn't untwine. We're just going to cinch it up over here. And then we're just going to do the same thing to the rest of them. I put it against white background so you guys can see the design and pattern, of course. Not the perfect design, but it works. Look how big it is. Now I'm gonna hang it on a tree and try to lay in it, see if it works. Got my hammock right here, and what I'm going to do is just grab a carabiner and put the two like this, like this. Pretty much to every loop. Some like that. And this is heavy duty carabiner. Now you see it's like a ball inside over here. Now I'm just gonna hang it on one side of the rope and same thing on this side with a different carabiner. There you go. And now you see that looks like a ball. We're going to lay down inside of it. Just remember, it's a rope so it's going to stretch out a lot. So make it kind of tight. Okay, let's see what happens. I'm going to try to sit in it carefully first and then going to try to lay down. Whoa. Okay, as you can see, it's stretched out a little bit. If we would have two sticks at the end, it would be even more comfortable. Ooh, it almost broke. But there you go, guys. What do you think? Look, I can actually... Wow, this is actually very comfortable. As you can see, it's stretched out quite a bit. So make sure you just readjust it and make it higher. So that way you don't touch the floor. I'm almost touching the floor, but this is 
very cool hammock out of the rope and of course there's more uses for the net but wow I don't even want to get up this is so comfortable well guys that's pretty much it let me know in comments below what do you think about this Leo project if you like this experiment please give this video a thumbs up thank you for watching and I'll see you next time